Right now, an Okeechobee man sharing his heart-pounding story after an interaction with a man he says was pretending to be a cop. News Channel 5's Jason Hackett spoke to him about the split-second decision he made and tells us what you can do should you ever be caught in a similar situation. Marlon Scott tells us he was driving home after a long day of work earlier this week only to see flashing lights in his rearview mirror. It turns out that was only the beginning of his ordeal. Maybe he was trying to rob me. Maybe he was trying to kill somebody. You never know. Moments of panic for Marlon Scott. He was driving through the Basswood neighborhood in Okeechobee County Monday night. Suddenly, a man in an SUV pulls up behind him. Actually, had a flashing blue light in his dashboard. I thought it was a cop for real at first, so I, I had to lean out of the window and look. And I got to a lighted area up here and I stopped. And he pulled up beside me and says, Pull over right here. I got a deputy on the way. Scott says the man didn't identify himself and he didn't show a badge. You're not a deputy? Oh, I can't pull over. And I just bolted on him. Scott says it led to a high speed six mile chase through the streets of Okeechobee. He comes behind me all on my bumper, I chased me all around, all down the street here, all around all the little main streets. Scott says he was able to shake the vehicle and make it home to call 911. You just can't be too, too sure. Michelle Bell with the Okeechobee County Sheriff's Office said Marlin had a right to be suspicious. She says law enforcement shouldn't approach without identifying themselves or showing a badge. If they can't provide credentials, 911 is your best lifeline. Advise them of what's going on, where your location is, the description of the vehicle, uh, and what they're doing. She says stay with 911 and drive to a well lit place like a shopping center or even the sheriff's department until you feel safe. Marlon hopes his story serves as a cautionary tale as he tries to figure out why anyone would do this. Why would you chase me like that? That's dangerous. You could have made me crash. You could have you could have made anything happen. One more word of caution from the sheriff's office. Make sure you pay attention to the make, the model and the tag on the car that way you can later report that car to law enforcement. In Okeechobee County, Jason Hackett, WPTV News Channel 5.